back to our reaction to Breaking Bad. Today we are watching episode 9, season 2. We had a good time last episode. There was... It was a grand old time. Uh, we were introduced to Saul Goodman. <laughs> The good man. People liked his character so much that the studio decided to do a whole show dedicated to him. So Is that what happened? I'm guessing. I mean, there really isn't another reason why he would have his own show. You know, it it's most likely because of the popularity of the character. Hmm. So, uh, so yeah, I know that y'all are probably excited if you've been following us uh, since the beginning. You're probably excited that we've reached this point. I'm just guessing. But yeah. I was mistaken. I don't think I mentioned it in the reaction, but I was mistaken. I thought that it was 10 episodes in season two and that we were pretty close to the end. It's 13. Yeah, it's 13 episodes a season and I was mistaken. So we still got a little bit to go, but uh, I, I feel I feel it ramping up, especially with the introduction of Saul in the last episode. So I'm excited to see how he integrates. If he's going to be a regular character, yeah, how he Bring integrates. Bring more people into the business. Yeah, the whole like crew has really expanded since it was just Walt and Jesse just like cooking out in the desert. I mean, they're still doing that because uh, they're the producers, but kind of interesting that they are actually building their, they're building their little empire and it's a bunch of misfits. Mm -hmm. It's a bunch of like randos that are like, <laughs> yeah, it's kind of funny. And everyone's like, Heisenberg. Yeah. And it's like, and they feel threatened by this, Heisenberg for something dummies. that they didn't even do, you know? Yeah. So it's like kind of funny. I think we need to see more of the family stuff, maybe. We spent so... two episodes. We spent two episodes on the uh, on the on the business side of things. So yeah. yeah, maybe they'll switch back and we'll get more family drama. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't know. Do you think they're doing, they're going to follow up on the affair scandal? Well, they set it up. They. That's what I mean. Do yeah. you think it, it might come to more of a head in this episode? Maybe. Uh, who's going to do the affair first? Skylar or Walt? I, again, not a, we're not assuming anything. I mean, we are guessing, but not sure that this is actually a thing. We just feel like they kind mm, of laid the groundwork. They might neither. Yeah. They might both. It might just be one. I don't know. What if it's Skylar, but not Walt? Walt has the opportunity. So then he holds it against Skylar. Oh, gosh. You know what I mean? Yeah. That she had an affair, but he could have, and he didn't. Oh. Right? What if that happens? So, I don't know. Yikes. I guess we have to but it out. is ironic that they did that in the same episode, you know, mm -hmm. was it in the same? It might have been in the same episode where it was like they mm -hmm. had a contrasting. At least it was in the same block of episodes. So, yeah. Yep. Saul totally is uh, not who I thought he was going to be. So if you missed the introduction to Saul episode, go ahead and watch that uh, where we were super surprised and having a great, great time because <laughs> it, it was so funny if you like this video please be sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more of our reactions also if you can't wait the next four episodes are up on our patreon right now so you can go join our patreon and watch the next four episodes and have fun binging them also be sure to leave a comment letting us know what you think of this episode and we enjoy our conversations with you guys and uh looking forward to this episode it's gonna be great so without further ado let us watch this episode of breaking bad we have not followed up on the bear thing bear yeah the house the pool and the bear I have these people yes Kleinman has better magazines you know are you they all at the cancer place really don't need yeah. to hang around we, we won't even get the results till next week i just still don't understand why you don't go to Kleinman. Well, this is where walt's doctor is i'm sorry but these scans are not that difficult to read. I could take one look at Waltz and tell you immediately how he's doing. Doctors like people to think that they're so much smarter than the technicians, but you would be surprised how much they come to us for input. <laughs> Hank is like... <laughs> no, never turned down a chance to hit the bathroom. <laughs> Excuse me. Never turned down a chance to hit the bathroom? What? You all right in there? Uh, yeah. Oh, he just sat down on the seat with his pants. He just flushed with his pants. Ew! What if the water squirts it up? It does squirt up. No. I hate that. Why? Us and our opinions. So creepy sounding. It's like otherworldly. See anything? 
I'm just a technician, Mr. White. Dr. Del Cavoli will go over the results with you next week. Ooh. Mm. That looks bad. Yeah. Was that a reflection of the screen? What? Was that a poster or a reflection of the screen? No, I think that was his scan. How did he see it? I, I think there was a monitor. Oh. That's what I thought. Gotcha. But I gotta tell you, the not telling your wife aspect, most people want to know why they suddenly got rich. <laughs> well, if she finds out, it's after I'm gone. Sorry to hear it. I was uh, hoping we could make some real money together. At this time, $16,000. Uh, how long have you been doing this? It's pretty light. We've had some extenuating circumstances. Yeah, apparently. Minus my fee, which is 17%. Oh my gosh. $9,960. He's losing everything. You just left your family a secondhand Subaru. You know, we should do something this weekend. Get our minds off the test results. She's really turned around. Yeah. Kind of weird. I'm thinking I should go see mom. Wow. God, Walt. I need you to. Stay positive with me here. I, I am. Positive is good. I need to know Mom's going to leave you something if, if uh, <laughs> I'm no longer around. Setting up his yeah. plan. I just need to get that straight, that's all. Believe me, I'm going to earn every penny of it, too. Complaining about her nurses the entire time. Her Juanita is hiding my ashtray. <laughs> Your room is very bright. Yeah. For sleeping. How are you going to go to bed like that? <laughs> I actually think the news from the scan is going to be good. Perhaps you should prepare for that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we should do something. Yeah, we should. <laughs> wow, no, they're just like... Else. They get along well. Happy in love. Uh, yeah. We should go somewhere. Georgia O'Keefe. She's a painter. You've never heard of George O'Keefe? Boy, you need some educating. Yes, yes, I do. You want to go to all the way to Santa Fe for a museum? Yep, we're going. <laughs> Get up. Oh, uh, can't we just go to the movies or putt putt? A little culture won't kill you. Uh, There's still cereal? Yeah. Crunch berries. Yo, if I know you. It's gonna be Walt. Here we go. Where the hell are you? Pick up the phone. Hello, Jesse. Pick up. I think it's weird that pe like voicemails are like loud like that. What? I know. Like pe with people in their home phones. To be. Where's your drop phone? Yeah. We have to cook. What today? Paper and pencil. You should be writing this down. Yo, you want to go shopping? Go do it yourself. All right. I got plans. Okay, man. All right. I'm going to a museum in Santa Fe. Not like you need to know. Georgia O'Keeffe. Georgia O'Keeffe. She's a painter, and uh, she does these vagina pictures. <laughs> her paintings are, are just painted. I don't know. What are you even talking about? Look, man, why am I even explaining myself to you, all right? I, it's, it's not your damn business what I'm doing. All you need to know so is So true. Or shopping or whatever the hell. Look, let me explain something to you. He's such you a bully. You need to cook <laughs> through to next He's Tuesday. He's such a bully. Tuesday, four days straight. Like it or not, we have no choice. Our methylamine, it's going bad. What? It's losing BS. Its Freaking it's liar. BS. He's such a liar. You. Hell no. <sighs> Come on. <laughs> right, right. It makes me mad that they wasted that pizza. Go. They could have kept it for leftover. I really wish you didn't have to do this. Uh, me too. Wow, but he's going through all this. You know. Did he buy a ticket? Like, does she ever look at the bank account? Does she ever look at their statements? Maybe he has his own account separately. Yeah, safe, okay. I guess. Okay. How is he gonna prove that he? That's oh, what I'm saying. Wait, she would never wants to talk to his mother, so he's pretty safe. She's not gonna talk to her. Yeah, I know. But so. I guess what I'm saying is like, how does she know that yes, he didn't spend yes. any money on it? He must any have tickets? his own bank account or something. And she's not. Yeah. This is uh, so ridiculous. He went through all of this just to lie. As Factory you said. Factory of lies. <laughs> <laughs> Walt, hello, I'm still a piece of garbage. 
<laughs> nice. Uh, thanks. What? Don't bring the meth machine. This is just hilarious. You brought a meth lab to the airport. What? You said we were in a hurry. You said it was a trip. Did you get everything? Go, drive, go, go. He's never satisfied. Yeah, I know. He never says good job. He always yeah, he has to stick up his butt. He just stomps around everywhere. He's so unpleasant to be around. Yep. Three entire bags of Funyuns. <laughs> Funyuns are awesome. <laughs> I used to like Funyuns when I was a child. Some protein, maybe? <laughs> Meat. Something green, huh? <laughs> oh my gosh, it's yeah. all crap. No service. Ew, there's like no nutritional value. How are you even alive? <laughs> the one time you yeah, agree with yo, Walt. check your phone. <laughs> I have to assume Skylar checks my phone records, you know that. It's not business, right? It's personal. Oh, no, personal. What, female? Skylar hits redial and some stripper answers. Look, she's not a stripper, okay? Dickwad. No, not there. That is our workstation. Oh, our workstation. That's right. <laughs> Why don't you try to find That's a so place funny. where it won't get lost, hmm? Considering it's our only set, and we are a million miles from nowhere. Why don't you try sticking up your ass sideways? Something's gonna happen with the keys. It's gonna be significant. He's, oh, he turned on the battery. That's what happened. He put, he put it in, yeah, okay. And, the, and now the battery's gonna die. Yep. And how are they gonna get it restarted? Yep, exactly. Wow, this is a freaking industrial situation we've got going on. They've got big equipment now. Mad equipment. Wow, they're just just working hard. Just having a great time. <laughs> wow. With they're their Funyuns? Just vibing. They probably have major stomach problems. Yeah. They're peeing. Wow, what a shot. How much you want to bet? Five pounds. They had to make so many Gosh. sugar crystals for this show. Yeah, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> So many. Wow, so How much. Oh, 19. Dang. Dollar wise. How much? So much. What are we selling for these days? 40 a pound. $40,000? And you said raise the prices. All right, that's 40 times 42 minus distribution charges. And your lawyer. You can do all that in his head. $672,000. Each. What? what? Each. He just made Each. like almost all the money he needs and in one go. Each. Each. So yes. fast. Hell yeah! What hey, the come heck? On, baby. Come on. I've seen yes. this. Come on. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I've seen that. His one moment of joy. Yep. Before it all goes to hell. Yep. There goes the generator. Perfect timing, y'all. They're so that? happy. It's going to end yeah. right now. Yep. We're done cooking. I am not done until this barrel is empty. Come on, where's your ambition? Jesus. Seriously? Oh, we are way out of schedule, man. Come on, can we at least just take the night off? Come on. There's got to be a Denny's out there someplace. <laughs> Red Slam. This is about to be so bad, guys. A shower. Mm, oh, no. They're so happy. <laughs> They're no, so happy, no! no. Yeah, this is like their one nice moment together. Oh. Shoot. Jesse, back when I asked you <laughs> oh, no. a safe place. Oh. Where did you put them? Left them right here in the um Son of a bitch. Whoa, whoa, no, this, this is not my fault, all right? The, the buzzer didn't buzz. Look, I didn't turn the key or anything, all right? I'm not stupid. Did you hear? I did not. It's faulty. It's a faulty mechanism. Is this just a <laughs> genetic thing with you? Is oh, it my God. Did, you, did oh. your mother drop you on your head when you were a the baby? The buzzer did not buzz, and you were the one that made me move the keys in the first place, remember? Yes, I see your point. Don't leave the keys in the ignition the entire two days. I wanted to leave them on the counter. Bitch! Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, the workstation. <laughs> okay, just you'll find your way All out right, of this, so guys. Come on. We need to jump the battery somehow. How? Ew. <laughs> that is so toxic. Are you gonna be man. okay? People have to do it sometimes. Oh, damn it. 
siphon gas. Uh, drink some water. This is good. This is good. Positive. Dude, it's about to all go up in flames, I bet. Oh. Something's about to happen. It's about to go up in flames. All of their hard work. Really yeah, cool. dude. There's gas they, on it? I know, there's gas, yes. No, really pull, not like we a spilled girl. it. Pull this. I am pulling. I only so guess that because I know everything is going to go bad. They made so much money. I knew it! I called it! Run! Oh, shoot. Get your, get your, get your meth! It's okay, but it's Thank attached. Goodness. Okay. Ah. Okay. All right. Well, All right. we still yeah. I guess that didn't happen, but okay. Now we have still a problem. Oh. And now they have no water. Well done, dude. What was he, he supposed so to do? so mean. Well I guess it wouldn't make any sense because where would they go from there? The meth. It would just everything would be destroyed. But I thought the whole thing was gonna go up in flames <laughs> for a second. Man, they need to get out of here. They need to get another car and drive it. Damn it! Okay, now we have to use your phone. This is ruined. Do you understand? It's just ruined. How do you know? You guys are so dumb. What I know is that I wasn't the one who dumped out the last of our water. That's what I know. There was a fire. Excuse me for thinking on my feet. Oh, is is that what you were, you were thinking? Ah, He's now that we've so identified annoying. the problem. You and thinking, that's the problem. Guys, just walk. Somebody, They're so irritating. Your wife is not going to notice one little call. Oh. She's going to notice. Make it snappy. Yeah, yeah. Listen, man, I need you to come pick us up now. All right, we're stuck out here. You got a pin for directions? Dirt Road, it's right before the white sign with a three on it. OK, now, now you're going to be way, way out in the boonies, OK, like crazy far. So you're just going to keep heading down that dirt road for, like, what? About another 15 miles. You go down that road for like 15 more miles, all right? I mean, we're way the hell out here. He's coming. He doesn't come for like three days. But we should just call. You know, I'll be quick. Just be like, yo, where are you? She's gonna notice. You think so? Mm-hmm. Why didn't he bring his second cell phone? I don't know. Seems obvious. Yo, yo, where are you? Oh, man. We're getting really freaked out. All right, so you're uh, you're on the dirt road. He's on the dirt road. Mm -hmm. Good, good. You just crossed the river. Yeah. Have you seen anything? No, what river? Yeah. He's hey, totally, yo, what river? He's totally Dude, in what a the hell river area. are you talking about, man? There's no river. Hey, yo, Pete. Yo, Pete, can you? Shoot. Phone's dead. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh! He's just giving up and dying. Swight. <laughs> what now? Well, that sucks. I feel like they should just leave now. You mean start walking? Yeah. Like through the night? Yeah. I mean, you don't want to be out while it's hot. I and mean, you need to be get moving. I mean, it'd take a while. Yeah. I mean, that's miles. a long way, but you're, you're already out of water. And it's going to get worse the longer you wait. Yeah. I'm trying to. Trickle charge the battery. Just by turning that thing? The commutator. It's the part which generates the electricity. My little elbow grease. It'll take longer. Oh, theoretically. How much longer? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> How do they even know it's working? Oh, no. Oh. And you hanging in? Oh, I'm good. Uh, this is not good. I'm ready by now. Right? I'll give it a little longer. Just to make sure. Oh. For me, it doesn't spoil. Yeah, you just figured that out? <laughs> That's not why we're here. Hey, he's got some good intuition. Lie much? <laughs> <laughs> Lie much? Yeah, actually, a lot. Quote, quote of the uh, of the show, Jesse. Lie much? <laughs> this is so bad. When do they try to start the car? Why aren't they trying it? 
I think because okay. if you try okay. Okay. and it doesn't work, you'd have to completely start no. o- start over because it would use all of the. I could be totally wrong about this. I'm You're guessing. just saying things with confidence. Well, no, because I'm pretty sure, like, because it takes power to start the engine, but if you don't have enough, and then, then once you start it, the engine is what keeps the power going. <laughs> but if you don't have, if you use all your power and the engine doesn't start. Yes. Ooh. Yes. That is so nice. As long as it doesn't die. No! No, please. God. No. God. He always punches stuff. I mean, he has been in some really bad situations. Wow. Oh, he's gonna get mad. Mr. White! Mr. White! <laughs> he's like, I am ascending to my forefathers. <laughs> Caitlin, what are you doing? <laughs> Goodbye. You know? Oh, man. Ooh. Oh, bro. This is how you're gonna go out? Really? Like, this is how you wanna die? Just being a fool? I have it coming. I deserve this. You at do least reap. He, at it. least he sees himself. You do reap what First you sow. Everything so, you did, you yes. did for your family, right? Wow, he's defending him. All I ever managed to do is worry and disappoint them and lie. It's true. Oh, God. <sighs> All the lies. Wow. I can't even keep them straight in my head anymore. It's horrible. Screw this. I'm walking. You can come or not. <laughs> Finally. I feel like they should have walked a long time ago. Jesse. Skinny Pete just gave Jesse. up. <laughs> He's like, uh. He's still out there driving, like, where are they? My body running dangerously low on electrolytes. And when they're gone, your brain ceases to communicate with your muscles. It's crazy. Your lungs stop breathing. Electrolytes are Welcome. literally life. Marching out there. Okay. You need to cut out all your loser <laughs> crybaby crap right now and think of something scientific. <laughs> scientific, right? Like, come on, man, you're smart. Or you made poison out of beans. <laughs> Look, we got, we got an entire. Yeah, come on. There's got to be something right here. To do. All right. How about you take some of these chemicals and Make mix some up magic. some some rocket fuel, <laughs> or you can just send up a signal flare, or you make some kind of. Robot <laughs> to get us help, or a, or a homing device, or <laughs> build a new battery, or. <laughs> no. What if we just take some stuff off of the RV and build it into something completely different? <laughs> what is he saying? Like a doom buggy. <laughs> that way we can just <laughs> doom buggy her. <laughs> He's so funny. What is Look it? at that. You can hear the music rising, the champion what? music. As he gets up. <laughs> do, you, do you have any money? Change, I mean, coin. Yeah, I got a bunch of them. Okay. Um, oh, electricity. Yeah, through them the and, metal. And, and, and washers and nuts and bolts and screws and whatever little pieces of metal we can think of that is galvanized. It has to be galvanized or or solid zinc. Solid zinc. Okay. And, 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 and is bring he going to make a battery? Bring me brake pads. The, the, the front wheels should have discs. Take them off and bring them to me. He's like, yes. Yes, <laughs> master scientist. What are we building? <laughs> Shut it yourself. Robot. <laughs> Battery. Yes. Move! Oh, robot. <laughs> I had to do that in my battery. chemistry class. We made batteries out of one cell of the battery. Coins and uh, yeah. uh, the last salt sponges. and water. Remember the and my paper towels. Wow. Huh? Well, think it's about crazy. it. On the opposite side is our anode. <laughs> this. It's zinc. It's what we find in our find in our coins and anything galvanized. Man, why didn't he think of this sooner? The, uh, <laughs> the sponge is the electrolyte. Good, and now, what shall we use to conduct this beautiful current with? Hmm? What one particular element comes to mind? He's being a teacher. Hmm? Hmm? Copper? Uh, Zinc and copper. Oh, no! Uh, 
Oh. Copper. <laughs> well, then, copper. Will this supply enough current? Uh, how many cells will we need? This is crazy. Okay. He literally took the extra sketches and created mm-hmm. a bomb, like a, you know what I mean, like a, mm-hmm. a bomb thing. Not really a bomb, but a thing to incinerate the lock. Anode. Damn. That is good. That is very good. Okay. Here we go. Moment of truth, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Uh, that was a whole adventure. It's crazy. And they have $1.2 million? Because he said it was 600 each? I know I can trust oh. you. To, uh, yeah. Right? Is that what he said? Yeah. Whatever happens, your family will get your share. Oh. Baby Jesse. And, but clearly there are some expenses that he's not considering. Like the uh yep. like the lawyer. He didn't so, factor in the um, lawyer, did he? I don't, um, know. I don't know, he said expenses he said something. They made it out alive. Where are they storing all that meth? Just in the R V in the Yeah. In the junkyard. How's everyone doing? Well, I have your scan results. Yeah. And you're showing signs of remission. Wow. I want to clarify. There are some misconceptions about what remission actually signifies. It does not mean that the patient is cured. Technically speaking, the tumor can remain the exact same size it was before, and the patient could still be in remission. Hope to see at least a 25 to 35% reduction in tumor mass. Something to tell me that the cancer has responded to the therapy. Walt, your tumor has Whoa! Oh my gosh! Oh my god. Wait, wait, I'm sorry. Wait, I'm really um I'm confused. Is 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 an eighty percent a lot? Yes, it's a lot. <laughs> Mom. Yeah. Yes, eighty percent is a lot. Okay, but I'm I'm I, no, wait, I sweetheart, you're right. It's very good news. It's very good news. <laughs> Oh my god! Are you kidding me? Oh no. Just when I tried to get out, they this, me back. This moment is so tainted. Oh no. This moment is so tainted, guys. It's horrible! Oh. <laughs> the pain! The whole reason he started cooking meth in the first place might be irrelevant. Now, that cough is and he could have just taken the money discuss. from his friends. According to your scan, oh Walt, my gosh. you have radiation pneumonitis. It's okay. This is fairly common. See that scary looking thing there? That's tissue inflammation. It's a reaction to your radiotherapy. I'll prescribe some prednisone. Tissue inflammation, because the other day I was coughing up some blood. You probably have a tear in your esophagus from the coughing, and that can be very serious. You could rupture and bleed to death. Uh. This is something that we're gonna have to deal with before you leave here today. I'm sorry, I just- No more secrets, Walt. With something like this, you have to call me immediately. Now with these results, we're not completely out of the woods, but now at least oh. we have some options. The most important of which is time. You folks have earned some celebrating. <sighs> oh my goodness. Yes! Yeah. Oh my God. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that is but so they still sad. don't know me. I, I got if you guys can't tell, like I genuinely am just like in my spirit, I feel like weary of that moment i really do because i'm like i want to be happy and i am happy for them but i'm also like we all know it's not ending well the joy the joy is fleeting How are you gonna explain that one? He sees the monster he's become. Yep. Dang. Ah. Ah. 
Okay. Oh, we did it. We did it, guys. We did it. This presents new problems. It, it gets more interesting. He is now a meth producing kingpin and that has some time to live. <laughs> and he's running from the law. And he might not be dying of cancer anymore. The thing about so... it, yeah, the thing about it is that he I think has been operating with the assumption that he was going to die very soon and that's why he's been the way that he's been, you know? That's why he's been so like excusing of the lies and stuff. He's you basically know? like, I, this isn't like real anymore. Like this isn't even me. Like, yeah, I'm just becoming whatever I have to be. Well, I yeah, like but, for like and as fast as possible for whatever the time I have left. But now he's like, wait, now he realizes this he has is time. like this is actually my life. Like this is actually me. And he's gonna have this to live with real. himself. And like he, it's almost like he snapped out of the like. He was the like fog he was like it. in a dr dr daze or something. Yeah. And then he like looks at himself and he's like, "What? J what did I do?" Yeah. He snapped out of the fog of it, and now it's like, "All right, this is for real. This is happening for real now." It's literally all on him. He went to Jesse in the beginning and suggested cooking meth. And he just set off on this path. It was sad when Jesse was like, oh, why didn't I just go to Santa Fe, you know? Yeah. Like. Why didn't you just stay out of all of this? Like, Walt's greed is what's going to, I think. Drag um, him down. Drag Jesse, you know, away from a life that he could be having, you know? Yeah. So, and memories that he could be making, you know? Yeah. Anyway. It was crazy when they were stranded. I for a second there was like, oh yeah, this show totally would do that, where it's like all the work that they just did is totally gonna go up in flames. <gasps> like they're gonna just lose however much money. What was it? One point two million dollars or six hundred thousand dollars each is I think it's around what he was saying. And and then I was like, that's so stupid. Cause then the methylamine would go up and it would be like they're they'd literally just like be over. It would be over, it would be mm -hmm. done. So that would be dumb. But but that was kind of scary. I mean, imagine being that. I had flashbacks to being stranded in Las Cruces. In <laughs> Las Cruces. It no, wasn't that bad. It was not like that. We were in the middle of a, <laughs> in a populated area, so it's fine. Uh, but yeah, it is scary when, you know, it's like you have to like really get creative and figure out like what you're going to do in a situation, you know, like. Even even like losing your keys, you know what I mean? And like you're if you're in like an area that is totally unfamiliar to you and then you lose your keys, you're like, oh no, what am I doing? You know? <laughs> so Yeah. I feel like she's gonna find out about the calls. The phone calls. He is so not out of the woods. Like yeah, he's he not. has so many his wives are gonna find him out. Like Yeah. They're gonna catch up to him. Yep. And it's going to suck. That's the craziest thing about the money that he's making is going back to the couple episodes before. It's like every dollar of that goes into worsening someone. Every dollar goes into someone becoming a slave mm. to his product. That is so crazy. Like every dollar that he earns is um is a dollar spent destroying your own life you know it's horrible it's just really really sad the system yeah just preys on people takes advantage of their worst moments and their worst like flaws yeah don't do drugs don't do drugs <laughs> i'm increasingly eager to continue so until next time yeah yeah i'm excited Please like this video if you liked it and subscribe for more of our reactions. And if you can't wait, the next four episodes are up on Patreon right now and you can go enjoy those right now. Also, please leave a comment letting us know what you thought of this episode and we will see you next time. We'll see you then.